Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. We're here on the Hunter Call of the Wild and today I've got a bunch of highlights from the past week's worth of live streams and there was quite a few interesting things that happened during this last week including probably the most troll goats we've ever got in a week's period and it was interesting to say the least. We also got ourselves quite a few decent diamonds and so there will be quite a few of those in this video too along with some rares and stuff like that. This is pretty much all from this past week so it'll give you guys an idea of what we find on like a weekly basis minus the stuff that I've already put in videos but the live streams have been really good to us recently most of the good kills we've got have been in multiplayer there's been a few that were on my map too and those will also be included in this video but yeah I hope you guys enjoy it I'm not going to talk too much longer because there is quite a bit of clips to get through but if you're brand new to the channel consider subscribing and turning notifications on I do post three to five times a week and do daily live streams so there's plenty of awesome content to be had also, if you haven't already, be sure to hit that like button. It is a huge help in the performance of this video. So if you want to help the channel, that is the best way to do it. But with that being said, let's go ahead and get straight into the video. Something makes me wonder if they did that on purpose with the goats. Made it so that fives were common, but getting an actual diamond one isn't common. Because if you think about it, that does give you guys like some more, some more excitement when you see a level five. And then even more excitement when it actually makes diamonds, so it would kind of make sense. I just don't think this is the big horns. I think this is the horns that are one below it. Look at that. There's not nearly as much a uh, curl and length to these. This one's going to be under 200. I'm calling it right now. This thing is sub 200. Yeah, 185. Holy. <laughs> that is a terrible troll. 185. Are you kidding me? How is this guy even a level 5? <laughs> wow. Another level 5 that is a guaranteed troll. And that is an awful estimate too. Upper estimate of 190. Um, I don't really care if we mess it up. Just take the shot. And of course we dropped it. Of course the uh, one that is a guaranteed troll <laughs> drops on the spot. That one horn is the one that scores like low 200s and just barely misses diamond this horn is the level 4 horn so yeah 18620 that's almost as bad as the 185 we got yesterday wow that sucks so much troll number 16 by the way this is the 16th troll that we've got and like 10 of those were from multiplayer that's rough really rough that's a wacky looking one though Seems like almost every stream we find at least one of these. What has our luck been with goats recently? But those do not look like good horns. Or wait. Actually. Wait a second. That actually might be good. But as I was saying, we always find one of these during a stream, whether it's in single player or multiplayer. Last time we found one in multiplayer. Now we've got one in single player. This looks a lot better than some of the others, but I've said that in the past and been wrong. But that one right there does look good. It looks really, really good. The horns are a lot more like straight out. We got him. Hopefully that wasn't spine. I think it's good. That should have at least clipped one lung because it was on a slope fast travel over there and go grab it that thing looks like a diamond I really feel like that one's a diamond please let this be a diamond it's a gold 20580 well that's my luck that's my luck right there again and it was actually a perfect shot we nailed it pretty good now the upper estimate is a couple points above diamond, so there is a very decent chance that this could be a diamond. It also could have a pretty good chance of being a troll. But with estimates being extremely random nowadays, it's really hard to say. And yeah, I'd say that went pretty perfectly. I think that might have been a hard shot even. That might have been a hard shot. 
Anytime I see an animal drop on the spot, it always scares me a little bit, but we were so low on the aiming point, I feel like that had to have been heart. Absolutely no way it was spine. Now, for the moment of truth, did we just waste like 45 minutes chasing after something that's just a troll, or is this going to be a diamond? It's a troll. <laughs> 109.20. That's unfortunate. Feels bad. No! <laughs> Sad day. Oh well. We at least got him down. Now we can focus on hunting something else. That's a big goat. I don't know if it's um the small rack or if that is the one that can make diamond. I don't think that has any chance of diamond. Knowing my luck. I think this one might hit 200 though at least. Might at least be a big one. There he goes. We got ourselves a lung hit. Are you gonna tax him? Only if this guy makes diamond. If he makes diamond, I'll tax him. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> well. That is a guaranteed troll. 202.70 and... Oh. Blitz had actually hit this thing twice already. Apparently. <laughs> Looks like you had shot this one, Blitz. Looks like you had smoked it twice. And then apparently... Apparently it was back at 100% health. Yeah, Blitz, I kind of figured that you just didn't want to deal with it. <laughs> and yeah. It was a troll indeed, and this guy in front of us is a guaranteed troll. That's our luck though. That's our luck, unfortunately. There is our guaranteed troll. I'm actually going to guess he's at the higher end of the estimate at least. Oh, exactly the same as the other, 202. That's so sad. Guaranteed troll. Unfortunate, guys. But it is what it is. Nothing new here. <laughs> We're used to troll goats. I might be just seeing things, but I think this has a better chance of making diamond than a lot of the fives we've killed. Not gonna lie, that one looks really good. We're finding lots of goats today. Two in multiplayer and now one here in single player. Beautiful. Nailed it. Yep, that's a vital. Nice. Well then, that was a nice little surprise. I don't think I've seen a four that big in quite a while. This guy looks good. It looks better than the last troll we got. Let's see. 203, but still nice. Solid goat. Very solid goat. Well, <laughs> Another one. I think it's going to be a troll again. I think this guy is going to be a troll. The only thing I can shoot it with is the 223 since David switched my loadout. Well, let's hope it actually kills it. I don't have much faith in the 223, but I'm pretty sure that was a troll anyways. Knowing our luck, at least it probably is a troll. Yeah, it's vital. That is vital blood indeed. Very low bleed rate though, because the 223 is garbage. Yeah, looks like a troll. Almost any time that the tips point up like that, it's a troll, so... <sighs> so close. 206.90. That was a good one. It was so close to actually being a diamond. That's so unfortunate, guys. That appears to be a troll coat in front of us. Doesn't surprise me, honestly. See if this works. We'll wait for him to lift his head up again. Looks like we smoked him. He is going down. If this guy ends up being a diamond, then 
this will officially be the best day of multiplayer hunting we've had for Tiawaroa. But that doesn't look like it. That looks like a troll. Definitely looks like a troll. And it is 201.20. That is very trolly. Extremely trolly. Well, <laughs> that is a uh, level 9 red deer. But that's the guaranteed troll, so a little bit unfortunate, but can't really complain. Multiplayer has been super good to us today. That sucks that it's the troll, though. Really unfortunate. Well, I can't do the 22 trick because uh, David swapped my load out. So we are stuck with using the 223 in place of our 22. Which means I can't do the 22 trick, but it looks like he stopped, so let's try to get a shot on him with the 7mm. And that was a solid hit. He's going down super fast, and he's down already. I had forgot how much power the 7mm has. Absolutely smoked him. There he is, the guaranteed troll. Still awesome looking, but... Not gonna be diamond. 240.30. A monster red deer, but not quite monster enough, unfortunately. Still really big, though. Still a cool red deer. That is a piebald, and that very well could be a diamond. Um, I'm going back to the tent to get the 22. We've uh, used David's loadout for long enough anyway. We can probably swap things out. Hopefully this will go well. It's this back one. There we go, we nailed it. Perfect. That went a lot better than I was expecting it to. Thought for sure we would miss. Alright guys, moment of truth. Is this one going to be a diamond? It's a big one to say the least, so... Let's hope. Oh... My gosh. Wow. That's insane. Point one off. No. <laughs> that was so close. We almost had a piebald diamond mallard. Oh my gosh. That's our first good thing of the stream, guys. Oh my gosh. Hello there. Why does it gotta be a female, though? <laughs> My gosh. I can't believe that, guys. We found an albino springbok. Oh my gosh. Right as I was talking about how I really wanted to find one of these, we finally got one. I am extremely happy with this right here. This is something I've wanted for so long. Um. Guess that right there. Albino 7460 female. Holy, that is a big Seekadir level 5. Well, since we're in multiplayer, I kind of want to take this guy out as quickly as we possibly can. So let's try to get an angle where we can get this guy down. If we can get this guy to go broadside. There we go. We got him down. That is an insane diamond. That one is a guaranteed diamond. It was extremely wide. I am super excited to get this guy. This very well could be over 210. Our previous best is like 216, I think 0.8. And this guy very well could be even bigger than that. That's insane. It's getting picked up. 204.30. Okay, so this is not the widest. It's the second widest rack. That's still really awesome. Not as big as our last, but still really cool. What a beautiful trophy. Get that thing taxed immediately. Dark spotted level 5, 204.30 scoring. I knew the second that I saw this river had no Sika zones on it, that there was a chance that this person had never hunted their Sika deer. And yeah. I'd say that's definitely the case because this level 5 was chilling in a really big herd and that is an awesome diamond. 
I don't know if I can get a shot. It's the wrong melanistic. What is this? I'm telling you guys, this happens every single time. I grind for red deer. I end up accidentally shooting a few females or taking a few out on the way and they are always the ones that come back as Mela. I never get a male Mela. There we go. That should be good. I think we got it. Also, where'd that Sika go? I saw a big Sika. Yeah, that's a nice four. Get that thing down for respawns. That's insane, guys. We got a Mela. Little Sika there. Ooh, there's a big four. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. What is going on, guys? Oh my gosh. Casey would be jealous. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Holy. What has our Sika luck been recently? We've had such good luck on Sika and Red Deer. Big male Sika and female Mela Red Deer. Virtually side by side. Okay, that's what we need. Right there. Oh no. Oh no. That's not what we wanted to have happen. Oh, what? Just got the 180 bug. Oh no, guys. Where is he? Uh oh. That looked like it should have been good. What happened? A little worried this thing. Or I'm a little worried that this was a good shot, but it just didn't register correctly. Guess we'll find out soon. That's sad though. Watch this be our biggest one ever. If this is our biggest ever, I'm gonna be really sad. Because our current best is 216.8. That one looks <laughs> looks pretty big. I'm kinda sad. Oh, it's not our biggest. We're... What? Hold on. I don't think that's anywhere near where we aimed. I aimed right here. Right here. And we somehow hit up there. Yeah, I'm a little confused too, guys. <laughs> I'm a little bit confused too. I mean, it's whatever, but that does suck. <laughs> that sucks. Well, <laughs> that right there is a guaranteed Diamond Sika deer. That's pretty cool. We got to get this guy down. Of course, the first server that we join into has a level five Sika. Just running right at us. That is so cool. Well, what a way to start a stream off, right guys? <laughs> Big male indeed. That is a massive male right there. Let's see if we can get this guy's attention. We got him. There we go, guys. Absolutely nailed it. I'm excited to see how big this guy is. That was a huge estimate. Absolutely huge estimate. <laughs> Look at the size of this guy. That is huge. That is a huge Sika deer. And I think it's a rack we don't have. I've never seen one shaped like this. That's so cool. How big is this guy going to be, guys? I think this is probably going to be one of the coolest ones we've had at least. Maybe one of the biggest. 215. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's insane. 215. And it's a rack I've never seen. I've never seen one go out in a perfect V shape. That is so awesome. Oh my gosh. Multiplayer has really been good to us with Sika Deer. I think this is the third Sika Deer that we've killed in multiplayer in the past, like, 
week, week and a half. That's crazy. And yeah, it's a brand new rack that we've never seen before. And that appears to be one of the big racks too. That is awesome. That is so awesome, guys. Uh, I've seen that rack though. This is a troll. <laughs> That's a troll. It's a troll goat. That's so sad. Very unfortunate. But I honestly don't expect anything else from the goats, man. Yeah, we'll still shoot it. But that's definitely a troll. Look at how those horns go straight up. Who knows, maybe it'll surprise us. But I think it's a troll. We got it in the lungs. Let's see. Maybe we'll get lucky, guys. Don't have my hopes very high, though. After 20 trolls, you kind of lose motivation for the goats. <laughs> or, uh, not motivation, but... Optimism. You lose all your optimism towards the level 5s. <laughs> we'll get a diamond eventually, but... Just unfortunate how often they troll. Yeah, Crix, we've had 20 trolls, man. 20 trolls and one diamond for goats. It's pretty sad. And this one doesn't look any better at all. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's a diamond! <laughs> Holy! That's a diamond! Oh my gosh, that's our biggest diamond too! <laughs> what? Oh my gosh, it finally made it! We finally got one to actually make diamond! Oh my gosh! I couldn't be happier right now! <laughs> oh my gosh! That's insane! It actually made it! <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow, that thing's almost... Actually, it's 1kg off of max weight. We finally got it, guys. It took us so long, but we finally got another diamond. I am so happy. I can actually... I can actually put a goat in the lodge for once. And it's our best goat yet. Not a giant, but it made diamond, and that's all I can really ask for at this point. It has been over a month since the last big goat that we got, and we have been trying to get a diamond one so hard, and just recently got ours. And you guys just saw him, 211.3, a lot bigger than the previous one that we had, which was 208.7. If I remember correctly, we got this guy, well, I guess it says it right there, we got it on 12-11, so December 11th was the last time that we got a Diamond Feral Goat. And this guy is much bigger than that one, so I'm really excited that we finally managed to seal the deal on another one. And it is a different fur type, so that's at least good. It's not any of the fur types that I like, but it's better than getting a duplicate fur type at least, and it does have slightly bigger horns to make it even, even more different. I have absolutely no idea where that albino springbok is in the lodge. I just looked around and I have yet to see where it is, so I'm gonna have to do a little searching around. I hope I didn't accidentally delete it or anything. I'm guessing I just dropped it in one of the other lodges, but I'm not gonna be looking around too much because I do want to save things for a video that I'm gonna be showing you guys tomorrow. We're finally going to do a Trophy Lodge tour. I actually recorded it on live stream the other day. And, well, I figured I'd put it here on YouTube also. So, look forward to getting a Lodge tour in the very near future. I finally went through and brought all of my good trophies into two Lodges. So, we've got our main one, which is what we're in right now. And then we also have the Spring Creek Manor that we put together quite a while back. I decided to leave that one as is because it turned out so perfectly when we were working on it that I decided it needs to stay as as is so besides the stuff in there everything in this lodge is now our best of the best and this guy right here is that 215 Sika deer this is easily my favorite looking Sika deer and I couldn't be more happy it is an absolutely awesome trophy and we also got some of the other Sika deer along here I don't think the uh, 204 is on this wall but this 206 right here looks very similar to it and in fact I think I might be able to go find that one that we got during this video. So I did end up finding that little Sika deer that we were looking for. He is right 
here actually and that is him a little dark spotted pretty cool looking seeker deer not nearly as big as some of the others we've killed but still a pretty nice find multiplayer has been producing a lot of good seeker deer recently and honestly i couldn't be happier they're one of my favorite species probably my favorite on tiawaroa Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, be sure to subscribe to the channel. That way you guys will always be able to see when I post new content. Also, be sure to ring that notification bell. That way you're guaranteed to get notified whenever I post a new video. Also, if you enjoyed, hit that like button. It's a massive help in getting these videos pushed further up into YouTube's algorithms, along with leaving a comment with a video idea or anything else that you guys would like to tell me. Be sure to do that also. It's a massive help too. But thank you guys so much for watching, I really hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next video. Peace!